no experience in a crime fighting he was never a cop no, he was never even a security guard you must see some doctor there that what kind of doctor him be eye doctor he is doctor what kind of doctor me not understand and and he's a deputy prime minister too me tell the country you're in a danger when you have a prime minister so wicked if you tell us if you don't have something where manufacture and a sell right it a sell to governments and like it a sell to individuals it a sell to governments and then buy it and if you not take it you can get treatment all if you have a heart attack and drop down hospital what kind of people them here what kind of evil them here so you have him to deal with and next to him you have a deputy prime minister slash security minister miss anna do nothing miss i just sit down there look at roger asleep i him that then how it ever work so all right so now then come on and say okay crime get out of hannah westmoreland the last couple of days it terrible make we put up when him soe state of emergency State of emergency here, there, and everywhere. Our crime still turn up since them start them state of emergency. Can you imagine? The state of emergency has never worked and will never work. Because as far as the Jamaican people see, one, when you announce the state of emergency, you put criminals on their guard to pretend like they're not criminals in the community, to stash their weapons, and to integrate or to migrate. That's what you do when you announce your states of emergency. Second thing again with the state of emergency. The way that it's physically done. So from my experience, this is how I've seen it. They have certain checkpoints. The police and the soldier them link up. And them set up certain checkpoints for when vehicles are passing through. They check people. You know how much time me pass through them, there's something that if me did want to be a bad girl, me could have passed through with gun, drugs, anything me want. You know how much people pass through them, the same thing, they are not, not happen to them and them have all kind of contraband. How can you set up a state of emergency in a way which is like you have the soldier, them and the police, them are work like them a traffic cop? Or oh, oh, that are going to help you with crime? You feel like, say, I'm going to drive through your checkpoint with gun a man now go drive through your checkpoint with gun because no you did all come and set up this so anyway it's not rocket science duh have some sense now like when you can't drink some tea we're going to sense or something or maybe a vaccine we're going to lick a sense me don't know what going on with them people yeah if you announce to a whole country so we are going yes so this so and this so and we are going to set up the few one, two months or whatever. You think say no crime is going to in them the two months, the in them the vicinity? And a rocket science, it's simple. The crime now is going to happen in a period of time. But you see, as you're gone, though, as you're gone, every gun de, de, dig up. Man come back from where they dig up, hide out with them next baby mother. Or over them grandmother also did lock up all long. Them dust down that and live in night for two months. And then them come back. When them come back and them hear one who did a chat up with police and who did a day with soldier and who did a this and who, what do you think will happen? Reprisal, revenge, more killing as them turn them back, watch and see. Because it happened down and be already, so we know it will happen again. This SOE thing don't work. State of emergency, nah, work. Right? Hey, mom. My mom said we need help from the Prime Minister of the Philippines to give Jamaican government advice on crime fighting. Yeah, because recently, since the theaters take over, crime cut in the Philippines, big time. And people did have said images, them where might take wicked and this and that, but not no wickeder than the crime we are going. So wicked for wicked then. But why them not try that? As far as when we see them not have no plan no strategy no nothing because watch ya if me are the government first of all if me i go to state of emergency me not announce it. we are running upon them right and when we run in upon them we don't have certain things in place already second of all you need to be having 
full investigations because we only hear of investigations in Jamaica. We don't actually see the result of these investigations. So you need to be having full investigations, undercover work, detective work, um, community participation, which is very hard for them to get. People don't trust them. So you're not going to find the community to participate much in a no crime solving. The people must say, look here, man, do no job, man. Do no job. On a security force, do no job. And so much corruption exists in the force. The people them can't trust them. Forgive them no information. The people them not trust them. It's been this way from when the people them just not ever trust them because they're not sure the people them say. Them, them are keep it clean and real. The people them know say them are interact with criminal. The people them know say them are tip off a criminal them. And the people them know say when them got stationed more while, them not really get the help of them go there far. So you're not gonna find the public support, but this public support is so essential in solving crime. Next thing again, them are dealing with crime from a reactive point of view. Them need to deal with it from a preventative point of view. What are you doing to prevent more gangs from forming in Jamaica? Why aren't you finding out who is at the root of providing 14-year-old, 15, 16, 17-year-old with machine guns? New gun to me, not a no old time gun, no old nothing. New thing, me attack, automatic. We you do about that? We do not do nothing about that as government, as minister, of this minister, of that the whole of them is one bunch of idiots, them not no sense. Not even regular, just regular, normal sense them not have. Much more sense for can solve crime. A criminal them have more sense than them. That's why the crime are prevail. Because criminal them just laugh after them and say, eh, I want them to start. I'm on you know me a ship out front tonight, though. Yo, Marva, you know me I come in. Yeah. Line up that room there for me now. Eh. Alright, me I bring two of my warrior them, see? Alright, stash off them shoes there for we till we forward. Cause we have some more come with we want to stash. So, go and match up that for me. I saw them do it. So, if a man I do things and don't want to get catch a thing, a man just so sit down. So, of course, a man I go do that. A man I go make a phone call like when me make a while ago or just move. More while a man don't even have to make a phone call because I'm governing thing. And I saw them do it. So when them keep on announce to the criminal, so them are come with SOE and them are this and them are that. Them are idiot. Them have no sense from the Prime Minister to the Deputy Prime Minister to the whole of them. Them have no sense. And them devious too. Because them want to live in a country where we appear for them private security. And we appear for them big grill and them alarm and them camera upon them house. And most people don't even have a gate on them yard. Some people don't even have a gate on them yard. I saw them want to live. And left the people them in the crime situation. Uno is a wicked set of government. And you see Uno, Uno have no judgment for face. The whole of Uno. Wicked. Man to woman, all of them, the two side. Right now, I don't have to mention the opposition because they're weak like a rat. I don't pay them no mind. I don't pay them no mind. I talk about who in charge now. Who in charge now? What they do? How can you continually say a state of emergency a year go to for crime? You don't do no work. You just take off your soldier, them take them from up a camp, can them go park up and truck back for much hours sometimes, them say them hungry. Them can't have a move from them post, some of them want to sleep. You don't even pay them good, you don't even take care of them good. See one police put out one letter since evening say, him, not, him have to buy him own shoes for how much year now. Him have to buy him own a uniform. Can you imagine? A JCF officer putting this out. Say how much years now I have to buy him own a uniform and you, him say you cannot send out police who under pay and not even get proper pay and care. Figure fight crime because them stress them a human being. What do expect? What do expect best performance and forward thinking and detective work for go through from people who can't even pay them bills? That make any sense? 
So if you have your police, them, you don't pay them good. Then you have your nurse, them, you don't pay them good. Pharmacist now get pay good. Teacher now get pay good. What do what, what they really expect? What do they expect? And can everybody migrate and go somewhere and look a better life? No. Some people have to stay here. So they need to fix the situation. Because where most people are see right now is so alarming. Man will kill man and have man either play football. The heart of the people, them wicked and cold, them wicked to woman, them wicked to pitney. Woman wicked to man, man wicked to woman, brother to sister, sister to brother. And them just have the place away and the country just look bad and it just embarrassing and shameful and just disgusting. To me, are the criminal them in charge? Yeah. That's the thing there. Are the criminal them in charge of Jamaica, not the government? Are them a ruling government right now? And they have them running scared. They have them scared. So then bring out the soldier them. And I had said on my show this week that, okay, we're not in a war, so the soldiers are available. We can use up their resources. But how? If you care them, go just park up on one lane and park up on one street and I stop people I check them vehicle, not even thoroughly. Hold up traffic. Um, targeting people who might attack back to them and they not like that. These are the things that happen in the SOEs. We don't see the SOEs bringing four tons of guns. We don't see the SO4 bringing forth lots of arrests. We do not see the SOEs bringing forth information from people who know what's happening. So that means it now work. And the people them don't tell them that already said now work. As soon as you see them SOE are done, all on them say to last for right back to scripture. As a matter of fact, in the middle of the SOE don't have serve. They might have some anti-violence meeting and one man walk right in. I shot a man in the meeting and kill him. And the next day, two boys ride past pan bike and kill man pan road. So answer this question. Them really a fight crime? Them really a fight crime? Just like a man with them really a fight COVID. Them not a fight COVID neither. Them just want, no one said the vaccine thing work out for them. It, the numbers go up. And them go along with the world order we are going all over the place because obviously it must be a order for everybody a force them citizen and a pressure the people them so hard look at Australia eh the people them in Australia are left out of the street them protest morning noon and night because them sick and tired of the government that try to force them with this thing and we the Jamaican people we get so we get so soft we so soft that's when people actually talk up for themselves and say, listen man, make this thing be that who oh, want choose it, choose it. Ah, oh, no one choose it, no choose it. It's like you become like an enemy of some people. You have some people who claim, say, them are some top intelligent people that say, oh, people might as well face the fact and take it. Really? So I see himself then come with anything where you not agree with for take you just gonna take it or do it then. Why may I tell you? <laughs> Thank you, Master Link. It's just crazy, like you have a country that has what them say two times the global average. And five times the regional average of death rate. That's Jamaica. So five times the regional, meaning Caribbean average. And two times the world average. And with the panel list, top five countries with the most murder per capita. And all them can tell you is SOE. So how long them plan for have a SOE for? Because now they all go outside their constitution, you know, because remember, say, state of emergency adjust for a certain period of time for a certain reason so where the actual like plan like day to day fit the crime situation we have never heard of one all we hear about is this soe 
You have a Kingston, you have in a St. James, and you have in a Westmoreland right now. So if that lasts for what? Two months. Like, after the two months? Yeah. And even during that, crime are going the same way. So that for sure them said, now nah, work. Or if you work, as me say, when you announce on yourself to them, you don't announce what you do to a criminal them. So everybody even who did a criminal now, just shape up themselves and be like a normal citizen for the time where you're there. Oh, you're going to know what criminal you don't know them. You put yourself in a situation where you can't do nothing. You just pose up some police and some soldiers someplace. And that's supposed to solve crime? People are kill people for no reason at all. People are kill people for what they think, what they hear say. Nothing for actually what they know are. There's no justification for it, but yeah, that's how ridiculous it is. People are kill people just because somebody disagree with them. You have family war are going for much year. This one hate that they want because of what they do to my mother and my grandmother. Communities, whole communities go against each other. My God. So what happened to the future? What happened to the pity them now? Hmm? What, what, we, what we left them for do? And me see it so them a new generation here coming up. Like the teenager, them and the young one, them the 20s, them, them worse. When me listen to some of all the lyrics, them what them a sing about the gun, them what them a control and what them a do, them worse. That's some of who we have a deal with already. We have so much violence going on. That's the youth, them find it as lyrics because some of them we are seeing the things them and what them know about from them community. Maybe them even know about it from them home. So how will we escape from the grips of crime? My mom says, um, the vax does not stay long in the body. People need many boosters. It's a money-making thing for big pharma. We know that, my mother. We see that and know that. So that's why I talk on my radio show in a week and say, I not really... Them not really want to get the numbers down. Them not, them not try to get rid of the virus, which the virus is there. Them not try to get rid of it. Them just want to work with the plan to get some people to take this thing. Meanwhile, the data and the thing which is just now being gathered, we are hearing that um, it's alleged that FDA is asking for some long time, I say 55 years, before government released that data. Now, in a 55 year, if sitting goes so, how much people are already dead? How much people are there and now are going to live 55 years from now? How much? No madness that. We supposed to get this data bit by bit by bit. So we can know how to adjust with this thing. But no. Them want to keep it secret and them want people not to be careful. Be very, very careful. We are going to live by a booster. Remember me telling you that. So, you know, me really have a concern about the crime thing more than anything else. Just like everybody who mean anything good for Jamaica. It's just terrible. Me not, me not know what we are going to do. What we we do. We can't help but depend on the government to come up with something. Because we, we self and a soldier and police. We, we self and a, like, you know, we don't have qualification to fight crime. But the people them need a solution because it's scary now, bad. It's scary upon the people them and a lot of innocent people are victims of crime in Jamaica. The people them, too much heartless people there, too much soulless people who don't care for others, who don't look into themselves and say, you know, say, that brother their mother never do me nothing. Even if you want to say, all right, you and the brother in a things, you and the brother in a war. What the brother and mother do you, man? What him sister do you? What him little daughter do you? Not, not all. See all the little young lady don't have served it. When them shoot, the, the youth, the artist youth, paparazzi, what do you hear? Them shoot a girl who in her house, you know. Now, I have nothing to do with what going out of the door, you know. This able person gets shot by a stray bullet in them house and die. The people them are kill woman, pitney, 
granny big man little youth it, it just may i tell you enough days me think about it enough things me hear and me, i'm literally cry literally cry people don't feel safe if you live in other country yeah. foreign jamaican who live a foreign them scared more than anybody else most of them when you see them online them i say oh them now come back here and them now this and them now that and if them come out hotel them as tea and some people have all them good good also them billion now when them come out tell them stay in because them build their house in a some community where crime turn up can you imagine can you imagine now this is for this is a situation for a country that has one of the most recognized culture cultural practice every little thing about where we drumming with food with style with music if only if only we could stay keep it that way on the world stage but on a side go on a side go on the world stage now we know one for crime more than anything else and that is very sad for any jamaican who love jamaica and when will this mayhem and, and tarnishing of, of, of such a beautiful country end? No end, no insight. The people them not optimistic. The people them not feel hopeful. Like this crime thing I go solve. That impossible, my mother. How, how nobody finna live in Jamaica. That's why I said earlier, I said, I know everybody ever can leave. Some people are gonna stay because them don't know no other way out. Not everybody can ever leave. So they need to fix it. They have a job to do. This government get the people them to vote for them. And then they just come in and just do whatever they want. Same thing what did that happen to them before. 18 years of government under the next set of people, them never much better. Them terrible too. 18 plus 4 because then they get a break then they come back with 4 and that's why the people them vote in this government because then it's sick of the other side 18 plus 4 hour 22 year of foolishness them go on with so that's why they're not even a strong opposition at this time nobody now listen to them or look upon them them have them own internal issues that go on and plus for them leader him come like him come like a soft swap same way so what what go happen? Me don't know if a martial law they want to bring in for the people them why they come with them a state of emergency because if then things say state of emergency for the next two months or three months or whatever them cause them not giving a time them just say SOE right if them things say that are gonna help it now gonna help and then when you think about a longer time now you have to think about martial law right and if a martial law then that a one whole different scenario i had said this past week in my show if they're gonna do the soe they need to do it different if you're gonna have to do it for a longer period of time then it can come as soe you have to be like a crime plan we are gonna last one period of time we're not gonna do certain things no for that who no need to announce them no need to announce it and disclose it work with the people them the 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 military force work with the police and the police work with the military and the people them forget this thing under control but none of that them do them look like a martial law them are pre like for just have soldier and police upon the streets for intimidate the people them they make the people them feel a bit um because some people are intimidated by the presence of the police and soldiers um and then some are comforted by it for the time being but as soon as them leave the people them start fret again them something they no self crime and i say yourself crime and i say you have to take drastic measures for self crime when it's out of control you have to do some things which is out of the norm you have to send in some undercover people you have to do investigation, you have to do detective work. You can't just have soldiers sit down and van back and police stop them and a check vehicle and a look and a search work. 
When Uno I do that, things are going right round there, so. Them people are liam. The government liam. Liam bad. Liam in every single way. The way how them are dealing with the people, them. The corruption with the heap of money scandal. The, the um, non-inclusive treatment of Jamaican tourism industry practitioners. The crime fighting, everything. They liam anti the book. Then Liam bad. Me see you see the Prime Minister go down and the one young police the down a west. And him go a west. Why when crime up in the area, then Prime Minister show up about him a tour. Brother, people them don't need you for tour place. The people them don't need you for tour, tour no way. The people them need the crime for stopping at them community so them can open them shop. And the goods truck them can start go back down a server. And commerce and the economy can run and people live in peace. And that the people them need enough to do. Get rid of the criminal them. On. Prime Minister Gano has served yesterday walk up and down. Like him a celebrity. You're not a star. Andrew Wallace is not a star. You're not a celebrity. Nobody know why you're autograph. you a walk up and down about tour. you a tour place where crime happen. Make you never down there many time crime before and prevent it. We don't know set things in place to make people afraid to kill people. We don't know why bring back death penalty, but we don't know why, mashallah. What kind of idiot government them here? Hmm? The man down at Westmoreland bought him a tour. So him go up at the policeman yard. The young police, you know, were just dead the other day, you know, I tell him I feel sorry for him, you know. Just like the one where they didn't care with Kevin Smith. Me say a young man like that. Oh God. The young man dead. Prime Minister Dunga the man yard yesterday. I talked to him, madam. I hear interview. Man I go say, Oh, he might apologize to the mother. And he want her to understand. Understand what? Understand say her son dead by the gun. And he was a good young man trying to help the country by being a police officer. One one the woman understand. Ding, ding, ding. Say alright for criminal just kill her son and Prime Minister can't give her sweet talk and then gone again. Prime Minister, and if you get rid of the security minister and find one tough man for deal with that job there. One with people them respect and one with people them can see to actually do something. And you, Prime Minister, you're not a star. You're not a celebrity. We don't need to see a walk up and down in your clocks. We can't wear clocks too. We're not frightened for you. Do your work, brother. That's what you need for do. Because your SOE them now work. And your little, your little announcement them. And your little apology and your little plan them now work.